at the frontiers of global medical research, the Rappaport Family Research Institute at the Technion Ruth and Bruce Rappaport Faculty of Medicine is a place where scientific and technological discovery is rapidly put to work to save lives. It was here that two scientists unraveled the ubiquitin system, revolutionizing our understanding of cell biology and bringing Israel its first Nobel Prizes in science. Here, scientists developed rosagilin, marketed as Azelect, a drug that today brings relief to millions of patients with Parkinson's disease worldwide. At the Technion, Israel Institute of Technology, multidisciplinary innovations find medical applications. Prolific networks connect university, medical faculty, teaching hospital, and the biomedical industries. The unique position of the Rappaport Institute in the diversely populated north of Israel ties its activities to the local communities. The Rappaport Institute covers many diverse areas of importance, including cancer research, immunologic research, genetics, and many other topics in basic and applied biomedical research that can truly fulfill the vision of the Rappaport family, which is to help mankind and improve the health of people all over the world. In 1998, Professor Joseph Itzkovich, in collaboration with scientists from the University of Wisconsin, reports the first ever successful cultivation of human embryonic stem cells, opening an entire new era of regenerative medicine. Today, Rappaport stem cell research promises potential cures to diseases ranging from heart disease to infertility to diabetes. If one looks at the world's scientific literature in stem cell research, we can see that the Technion scientists have among the most publications in the highest standard journals, science, uh, stem cells, and many other journals. Technion scientists and labs are sought by collaborators from leading universities around the world, MIT, Harvard, the West Coast of the United States, Europe, Asia. So the Technion really is at the epicenter globally in this area of research. Over the last 10 years, we were able to derive uh, new embryonic cell lines, culture them in completely defined condition, make unlimited amount of the cells. It's a matter of just few years, maybe one, two years, those cells will be used in the clinic. Using stem cell wisdom, Professor Lior Gepstein and his group were the first researchers to successfully recreate human heart tissue. Our work using embryonic stem cells allowed for the first time to generate in the lab heart cells that have the molecular, functional and structural properties of heart tissue. Gepstein's scientific contributions to cardiovascular regenerative medicine could one day bring humankind the capacity to reconstruct a damaged heart. The fine art of molecular research at Rappaport also finds worldwide application in unraveling the mysteries of the brain. Professor Jackie Schiller is investigating the central nervous system to understand the cellular mechanism of memory and learning. Her work will speed up the refinement of medication, treatment and cure of neurological diseases. Professor Musa Yudim, who pioneered the drug Rosagilin for the effective treatment of Parkinson's disease, has now developed a new generation of multifunctional drugs that treat many afflictions that tend to accompany Parkinson's disease, such as cardiovascular disorders and dementia. We are very excited and confident that the new multifunctional drugs that we have developed and that has attracted the interest of major American companies will become successful and we hope this will be a great boost for the Rappaport Institute, Technion, and the State of Israel. Nobel Prize winning research by Professor Aaron Chekhanover and Avram Hershko reveals the regulating function of the ubiquitin system within each living cell. Their research signals the way to new medical applications, from new cancer therapies to treatments for neurodegenerative disorders. Professor Israel Vladovsky is also pioneering new treatments for cancer with 24 issued patents and 22 patents pending. The secret of discovering new drugs is first to unravel basic mechanisms. Based on our discovery, one drug uh, was developed already to combat cancer. Many other drugs are in the pipeline. We are continuing our efforts to unravel basic mechanisms that are involved in malignant transformation. And I hope that novel drugs based on those discoveries will come from the Rappaport Institute. Leading expert in hereditary skin diseases, Professor Eli Sprecher, researches the unique population of the north of Israel. Decoding the genetic defect for one rare disorder,
he perfects the research methods for diseases such as cancer and inflammation. So this is uh, how we get from something extremely rare to something of almost universal relevance. Of course, this also leads to the development of new drugs, new therapeutic approaches, new therapeutic uh, strategies. Each discovery in medical science can save lives. BioRap Technologies Limited is Rappaport's portal for technology transfer, offering the industry advanced biomedical solutions for contemporary healthcare needs, bringing the fruits of scientific discovery all the way to the patient's bedside. The role of BioRap and its main goal is to provide the Rappaport Institute members a full spectrum of protection of their intellectual property and to commercialize it. Based on the innovative research of Professor Nathan Karin, BioRap is offering potential treatments for cancer and a range of inflammatory autoimmune diseases. Professor Andrew Levy has developed a genetic test to customize the treatment of diabetes patients, dramatically reducing the risk of cardiovascular or neurological complications. The Rappaport Institute members are composed of scientists and physicians and the combination between those two assists us very much to understand the need of the market and bring in better solutions for patients. The Rappaport Institute is a unique entity within the Faculty of Medicine and within the Technion. It was built uh, based on the idea and the generous contribution of the Rappaport family. Its operation is also unique. Ideas are floating around and it generates a wonderful atmosphere to carry out research. It's clearly edge-cutting a modern research institute that I'm truly and deeply proud uh, to be part of. We've had this wonderful track record of success over the past 20 years. A Nobel Prize for one of the most important discoveries ever in the history of medicine. Well, that inspires us to think out of the box about the future. Global outreach, interactions with major research institutes around the world is going to be very important. The fact that we recently established a mechanism or vehicle for translating the basic biomedical discoveries that emanate from this wonderful institute and the Faculty of Medicine into applications that can actually help populations around the world to try to anticipate the problems and breakthroughs of the future way ahead of time, and that we hope will be the secret to our success. From the laboratory to world medical industries to better health, the synergy between Technion, Rappaport Faculty of Medicine, and BioRap brings a special added value to the field of biomedicine. From the creative inspiration in the scientist's mind to applications of remedies at patients' bedsides across the world, Rappaport brings medical wisdom and healing to Earth. <laughs>